Kali soon return with something big and wild in the mouth. Ila dug a hole in the ground. She was pretty good at that. Kali planted the seed in the hole. Then Manu covered the hole with soil again. Bini and Busy brought water in their sprouts from a pond nearby and watered the seed. Tiny the caterpillar stamped on the soil with his feet to make sure the seed was snuck in its bed. Then they waited and waited some more and waited some more. Then they grew a little tired of waiting. Night was beginning to fall, so Kali took them all to her house for the night. In the night, under the ground, a little magic happened. One little shoot peeped up from the sea and pushed its way up, up and up through the ground. One little hand peeped up from the sea and pushed its way down, down and down into the ground. The shoot grew thicker and taller and taller and taller. It became a big, strong trunk and spread out its branches into the sky a bit like how you stretch your arms when you wake up every morning. Then lots of lovely, fresh, green leaves appeared on the branches. Between the leaves appeared tiny buds. The buds became flowers and flowers ripened into fruits. Below the ground, the roots also spread out into branches and became thick and strong. When morning came, everybody was